feel so lucky. We took a chance while at Disney Springs tonight and went to the hostess stand to see if they had anything available for a party of three, and they did! So we get to have a lovely dinner. Hi! <laughs> we get to have a lovely dinner tonight at Morimoto Asia. I have gotten to have Morimoto in Vegas and it was absolutely amazing. Manny was not with me so I'm super excited for him to have his first try. Everything is so good. The smells, the, for, this restaurant is gorgeous too so it's going to be a blast. What do you think baby Yoda? Ooh, so good, right? Annabelle's trying some new stuff, huh? You have the yuzu soda. And a yellowtail uh, sushi. And we also got something else. Where do we get the spicy tuna? And a spicy tuna roll, which you've never tried. And a what? Yellow yellowtail. Fin? And I'm going to get the, I'm gonna get the Why do you keep duck? saying fin? Oh, oh she's going to get the duck ramen. duck ramen. You are going on a limb, girl. Duck ramen. Love it. I, that duck ramen sounds you delicious. You can have some. Half, uh, three, or in yep. half. And that's so thin. Oh my God. It's so thin. It's like perfect. Do you know you have like, to train for a very long time it's to like be a, a sushi chef? Yeah. It's a very skilled art. It's, an art. it's not something you just do. It's something that... You go through what a lot of training tweet? for. I got a lychee martini. I Look at that. this thing. Look at that. Lychee. That's one of them big tuna eyes. Dad, what does this mean? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. This is delicious. Mine is good. What is it? Oh my god. Like, like, wet your lip. Don't, don't. That is the perfect amount. What is it? It's a lychee martini. Mama, oh, yeah. this is good. It's amazing. This is delicious. Mm -hmm. That's a fancy. Wow. This is the hibachi sauce. Or soy sauce because she's got this dry thing so that tastes even better. Perfect. Mama, do you want to taste mine? Wow, that's good. Mama, do you want to taste mine? I do. The daddy's is good. That has a spicy aftertaste, too. Yep. Really good. Yep. All right, when you get ready. Okay. The ingredients for your um, curry pot this afternoon, we do have our sesame spinach, a little bit of the fermented carrots as well, our daikon root radish, oh, yeah. and our special ingredient is called zenmai. Now this is a royal fern from Japan, but it has the same taste and texture of mushroom for your entree for today. Very good. Now to help the egg mix it all up, it's our bop sauce, soy be soy, sesame seeds, and a shisho mint leaf as well. A little more. Our entree does have some history to it. Back in 1999, Morimoto himself, he used the same exact dish for his iron chef competition. Now that night he did win, continuing the generational reign of iron chef Morimoto. And that night he almost lost the same exact dish, that's why it's so special to chef. Now the reason why he almost lost is because to make the berry bop, Morimoto was inspired by a dish called a bibimbap. Have you guys ever had a bibimbap before? No. No. Now a bibimbap, <clears throat> Bibimbap, it's kind of a similar premise. It's a hot clay pot. They put all the ingredients individually and they make that table stock as well. The biggest difference though, a bibimbap is a Korean dish. And the catch is that night, Chef Morimoto, he was doing a Japanese orange competition. Uh -oh. So he submitted, got it. So he submitted this Korean dish or Korean inspired dish for a Japanese competition. They didn't like the idea that too much. They thought the judges thought of it as non traditional in their eyes. Yeah. The thing is for us in Morimoto, it's a fusion entree, two cultures together in one place. So the chef, he thought he didn't do anything wrong. So he brought it out anyway, and he did table style with the judges the same exact way we're doing for you guys tonight too. That gets nice and emulsified. Yes, it is. Perfect. Beautiful. Now, I know we didn't capture the beginning film, so remember how it looked when I first brought it out, right? It's very nice yeah. and organized. Gorgeous. Now, the trick is at the end to put it back together the same exact way it came out. Chef did it for the judges, and we're going to do it for you guys tonight too. First step, make a little bed for the fish to sleep on. Grab the hamachi. Now, it's going to be a little undercooked or sashimi, the texture. Perfect. Well, a very nice sear on the opposite as well. 
You guys have the best of both worlds. Slightly yeah. sushi, yeah. slightly cooked seafood for the evening. And also got to show you how the bowl is. We had cooked off one side of the fish. So of course, again guys, to be very careful with this dish. Thank you. Of course, totally not. So the very bad and the fish might want it, the extra sauce. Oh, maybe. Great. I hope you guys all enjoyed dinner for today. Thank you Thank so you. much. Well that was amazing. Well Thank you. Look. Oh my gosh. And Annabelle has her duck ramen. Wait, is that actually duck? No, no, no. That's a regular egg. Oh. No, it's cooked egg. Everything looks great, and thank, thank you. you. Thank you. And I got a pork lettuce wrap. Manny, look at your cocktail, too. Yep. Japanese old fashioned. Japanese old fashioned. This is a lady, I forgot what he called it. I will look it up, but it looks gorgeous. This was an experience. I, I'm so that happy we were filming it before. Like when you from the beginning, yeah, because wow, yeah, the story wow. with the yolk, wow, was that cool? Wasn't right, that so neat, see. Annabelle? But did you watch him? He cooked it right here in that pot, in the clay pot. Okay, so we enjoyed our meal so much, and our server and the sushi chefs at the table there at the sushi bar that I totally forgot to record what we thought of everything. It was absolutely awesome. We will be coming back with all the rest of the kids. I can't even tell you. Look at these. They're like, um, they're fishing baskets. It's just gorgeous. And the colors, they do change the light in here to be different colors. It's just it, this place is stunning. It is so beautiful to even just be in this space, but this has been an absolutely magical night. I cannot say enough about this experience. You have to come and check it out. It was awesome. Absolutely awesome. Right. With you and I, the future is bright.